Hello, beautiful stars. This is Selena Rhiannon. Today's meditation and the light language following it is to help us anchor fresh new energy into our heart chakra. We're going to be working today with anchoring between Mother Earth and the higher realms, allowing the energy of the heart chakra to be the column of energy with which we can receive information and guidance, as well as perspective. Go ahead and find a place to either sit or lie down, whichever feels comfortable for you during meditation. We want to make sure that we are in a distraction-free area as we're doing some inner healing with this meditation as we open up to the divine and to our heart and our higher selves. When you are ready, go ahead and take a nice deep breath in through the nose and exhale out through the mouth. And if it feels right, go ahead and close your eyes so that you can go within this experience and really connect with the imagery. And as you are breathing, just imagine that any tension you are feeling or sensing to just melt away with each breath so that your body is becoming more and more relaxed and centered here in this moment. Just give yourself some time to put away any thoughts that you may have or any concerns or doubts that you may have about this experience. Just allow those things to float away now as if they were bubbles on a breeze. And as you continue to take in those nice nourishing breaths, imagine now that any energy that is not yours is just leaving your body. We have a tendency to pick up energy from other people and other places where we go throughout our day. Just allow any energy that is not yours to just gently leave your body in your auric field now. And just like we can pick up energy from other people or places or things, we can also leave our energy elsewhere. Go ahead and call back your energy so that all your energy is coming back now from all the people and all the places you've left it. Just allow that energy to come back now, taking a nice deep breath in, calling it back. <sighs> Just allowing that to become a cyclic process as you breathe in, you're breathing more and more light and more and more of your own energy back into your body. And you feel lighter and more relaxed with each breath. Just allow yourself to tune in to how good that feels, to have all of your energy, as well as letting all the energy that you've been carrying around just go for now, just letting all of that go with the wonderful vehicle of the breath. Good, good. Excellent. And so now, as you're going into more of a relaxed state, I invite you to bring your awareness now, bring your focus now, into the center of your chest, into your heart chakra area, into your heart. Just gently tuning in now, just observing how your heart looks right now to you. Just gently noticing what you're sensing. You may be seeing colors or images. You may actually be hearing sounds or music. You may be smelling a nice scent. Just allow yourself to take in what you're experiencing as you connect with your heart center. And as you tune in more into this space, just do some gentle inquiry. What does this area of your body look like? What images are coming up for you now? How do I feel 
about this area of my body? How do I feel about my heart? If you feel that there is any judgment or pain coming up, just allow yourself to pause here and breathe. Breathing through any of those feelings, just allowing them to come up, knowing they are valid, that they are important, and just invite them to come back at another time. Just invite that to fall away with the breath like feathers, just light and delicate. And if you feel there is too much pain, please give yourself permission to pause the meditation here and do whatever you need to do to help put yourself in a heart-centered state. Whenever you are ready, I invite you to just keep your awareness here in the heart chakra area. Just noticing what it looks like vertically and horizontally. Imagine yourself pulling away and visualizing your heart from all angles. What does the heart chakra look like between your shoulder blades from behind as if you were standing behind yourself? What color is it? What are you noticing about it? And then allow yourself to do a 360 degree turn so that you can see all angles of your heart chakra. Just gently taking notice of what you're experiencing and what you're sensing. Now let us bring awareness to the core of the heart chakra. If you're not already seeing colors around your heart chakra, I invite you now to see it as a beautiful green color, the color of green grass. Just allowing that beautiful color of green to permeate your entire heart, your entire chest cavity so that that beautiful green light is now filling that whole space. And as you continue to connect with this luminous green light that is emanating out from your heart chakra, I invite you to send some of that green light down through your body, down into your legs and out the soles of your feet into the earth. And as you do this, you may even feel tingling at the bottom of your feet. Just allow that energy to continue and send it down with love, with joy, down into the earth, down into Mother Earth. And you begin to feel you have roots anchoring you there, keeping you solid and firm and centered on Mother Earth's body. You may feel roots pushing through the soil down into the cool darkness, just allowing that sensation of feeling rooted and calm and grounded to be with you now. And now I invite you to continue to visualize that green energy around your heart and to send it upwards now, up through your upper body, into your neck, your head, and out your crown chakra, out the top of your head, and shooting it up into the heavens like a green ray of light, sending all of that beautiful light upwards, up through the clouds, into the heavens, so that it is tethering you to the heavens 
tethering you to the higher realms so that you feel anchored from below and anchored from above. The heart chakra is a six-petaled flower. It is expressed in a symbol that is three points up and three points down. This means as above, so below. If you see this symbol, you will always remember that it is the heart chakra, for as it is pictured in the body, you will notice that there are three chakras above on the body and three chakras below on the body. This is our center point. This is the center that we can return to at any time. As you feel this beautiful, gentle exchange of anchoring energy between you and Mother Earth, and this beautiful, inspirational, lightning energy with your crown chakra in the heavens, allow this column of green light to extend far from up in the heavens, down through your crown chakra, in through your third eye, your throat, down into your heart, and allow that energy to sink down now, down into the other chakras, your solar plexus, your sacral, and your root chakras. So that energy is shifting down now, pouring out the bottoms of your feet, where we actually have small little chakra points on the bottoms of our feet, allowing that energy to continue down now into Mother Earth, making this really solid column going from the heavens down into the earth through your body. As you visualize this, you may start to see other chakras also awaken and begin to spin or clear themselves of energy. Some people see it as a muddy wheel spinning off mud. Some people see it as a pinwheel shifting in the sunlight. However you experience your chakra, begin to see your green heart chakra now spinning like a wheel, gently spinning like a wheel. And as that energy moves, begin to take another 360 degree scan of your heart chakra, feeling tethered still to Mother Earth and to the heavens know that you are divinely protected, that it is this stream of green light that is coming down from the heavens and coming up from Mother Earth. It's making this beautiful energetic exchange between the heavens, Mother Earth, and your body. And so begin this 360 degree tour again of your heart chakra. What does it look like from the back now? What are you noticing, if anything, that's different? Allow some gentle inquiry now. How do you feel? What are you sensing through your five senses? Is there any new information or wisdom that's coming from your heart now in the form of messages or images or sounds or scents. Take a few moments here to just gently notice what you are experiencing. Let's begin now to slowly pull back more into the present moment as we come out of our hot chakra area and back into our body fully. Let's take in a nice deep breath together in through the nose and making a soft sound as you exhale through the mouth. Know that anything you've experienced here in relation to your heart chakra will be remembered. Anything that is important to recall later it can be recalled. Give thanks now for the presence of 
anything that you've invited in here, as well as your higher self. And know that if your heart chakra feels like it needs a little more maintenance, that you can repeat this meditation at any time or any version of this meditation. Just allow yourself to come fully back now. And when you feel ready, go ahead and open your eyes. If you've had a particularly deep experience, you may want to journal your information that you've been receiving to help you understand later what you may or may not remember later. Sometimes we go very, very deeply into meditation and then our conscious mind can't recall those details if we don't write them down right after the meditation. But just jotting down some notes can often jog your memory to help you recall more later on. And if you would like to deepen your experience with this meditation, I encourage you to continue watching the video for the light language transmission. From my heart to yours, I hope that you enjoy it. Many blessings to you, beautiful star. Shasamat. 